Welcome to this lecture. So in this lecture, uh, we'll be uh, importing a, a Landsat image and um, exporting it to our Google Drive. That's the you know exercise that we're doing in this um, in this case. So let's load uh, our Landsat image as always. So let's load Landsat data. We'll create a variable um, Landsat eight and. Um, I'll use Earth Engine image and then provide the image ID. I already know that. And then let's select uh, the bands that I'll be using. I'll choose band um, 4, 3, and 2. Okay, um, that will be it. And um, let's create a visualization bar. Actually, we don't need a visualization parameter. And then let's um, let's create a, a region because this is large data. So mind you, when you export a large data, you're just consuming a lot of processing. So I usually want to export uh, on a smaller subset area. So let's create a, a region and so our region here is, don't worry about it, this is just, um, I already have created this um, location or this rectangle, so you don't have to memorize or worry about it. And if you want a different location, you can just uh, provide um, um, a different location, but then the Landsat data has to match that location. That's just the main thing that you need to do. So I'll uh, create a variable region and EE geometry. Um, Earth engine and then rectangle. That's a built-in origin function. Once you provide coordinates, you will create a rectangle. So I'm providing um, this, um, um, sorry, that's a number. I don't need a quotation. Uh, provide this lot long coordinate information for this um, you know, rectangle and then it automatically uh, would create um, um, uh, the rectangle on using this um, Earth engine built-in function. Okay, so this is my uh, coordinate. So that's my region. I'll execute that. Awesome. And the next step is actually to write the export function. Okay, just um, exporting to Google Drive. So let's um, create another cell here. And um, let's write export to drive. Okay. Okay, so let's create a function called task. Okay, ee bash, that's an Earth Engine built in function. Export um, image and then to drive. Okay, so that's an Earth Engine built in function. And then we'll open a curly bracket to enter our parameter here. Okay. So the first parameter in the export is uh, defining image. So this will ask you what's the image that you're interested. So this is our image, Landsat 8. That's what I want to export, okay? And then comma, the other one is description. So the description is more like to for you to remember like what the data is. So we can say image to drive example. That way you can remember what the data is. And the other one is just a folder. It will act, um, so you have to define an existing folder or you can create. So if you provide a name that's not existing, you'll automatically create it. So example, folder, okay. That's the under quotation actually. And the next thing is um, to define um, scale scale is technically the spatial resolution of the data in this case it's a 30 meter since it's a lanza data and the last thing um, in this parameter export parameter is a region so we have created a rectangle here right so we'll just call that we'll use this rectangle to export that means the size of the image that we want to export is this one but it doesn't understand the uh, coordinate information. So if you use the raw data, so instead what we use is region get info 
and that way um, and then we can extract the coordinates by writing coordinates this will extract the coordinates automatically and that way um, it will um, it will create the the export before we uh, execute the export we just need to start the export so this is our task so we have to say task start that will actually initiate the export first let's execute the the importing the landsat data and then export okay if you see the folder here it's empty so we'll refresh to make sure that it's uh, exporting so it uh, should be processing and uh, should, we we'll, should be able to see in a, in a few seconds here the data and mind you the name that we have given the the description the the name is the image to drive example so in this folder we'll see the the image hopefully fairly soon just refreshing if the export is processed already might take a little uh, few seconds now excellent so now we have image drive example t file here that's our landsat image and it's a 15 megabyte size so that's um, how you would export um, uh, to your google drive um, in the earth engine python api and collab